I'm Diana Terranova coming at you live from the red carpet of an event for the real Stanley and the John Wayne Cancer Institute. As you know, cancer is one of the most serious problems that we have as far as health is concerned. And whatever money is given to the John Wayne Cancer Institute is used for cancer research, period. I'm here with Terry Naughton and Rich Ahrens. And not only are they famous, talented artists, they're like really, really philanthropist type dudes. I donated a painting called uh, North Meets South. It's uh -huh. uh, kind of a polar bear penguin piece. That's so cute. Thank you very much. And I heard you also like worked on Beauty and the Beast and I all did. sorts of... I animated the Beast and Beauty and the Beast and uh, the Genie and Aladdin, uh -huh. um, Zazu and Lion King. I worked on about 17 uh, Disney movies. Only 17, not 18, because you know, like, Stan Lee holds the Guinness Book World Record for having over 18 of his comic book characters turned into major motion pictures. Like, did you know that? I know it now, but I believe you. Stan Lee is already the holder of many, many Guinness World Records. For example, over 18 of his original comic book characters have been adapted into feature films. And that's not even including the new Iron Man 3. Over 18 of your comic book characters have already been turned into major motion pictures. Only 18? We have a long way to go, right? I know. So is Romeo and Juliet the War going to be turned into a major motion picture as well, Stanley? It better be or uh -huh. we've wasted a lot of time on this book. Well, Terry Dugas, is there a chance that Romeo and Juliet the War will be coming to the big screen soon? Everyone wants to see their work on the big screen and we had a great writer, we had a great artist, mm -hmm. New York Times bestseller, you know, we did the, the Guinness World Record. Of course we want to see it as a big movie or a game and we're going to work on all that stuff, you know, slowly. It takes a while to make a movie that big, so we'll see. First we made a very big book, <laughs> hopefully then one day we'll make a very big movie. Maybe just like The Avengers, it will become the second or third biggest grossing movie of all time, Romeo and Juliet the War. Is there a chance Stripperella's come into the big screen as well? We would hope so. I'm sure Stan sees it as a, a comedy action adventure, you yes. know, so we, we both agree that it should be something like a... Uh, 3D! IMAX 3D, <laughs> yeah. Stripperella. Yeah. An Austin Powers type of tongue-in-cheek type of deal. I heard you're a really, really nice person too, and you donated artwork tonight too to the auction. Yes, in a big way. I donated a great big painting of Turby the Turtle Duck, which Aww. is uh, my uh, character in my children's books. So I heard you've done all sorts of cool movies too. Um, I produced Animaniacs, mm -hmm. Tiny Toons. Uh, Animaniacs. <laughs> <laughs> so did you, did you ever go to the water tower? Well, it's a military secret. I want to go inside. Will you take me there? Okay. Yay. <laughs> it's amazing that you remember all of this. Well, I can remember anything and do anything with the real Stanley because you make me feel like a superhero. Thank you very much.